Phil, it's late. Oh, well, I, I'm sure this bill is going to come up for vote in the next session. And it's got to be bulletproof. Well, isn't all this reading what legislative assistance are for? Oh, for God's sake. And uh, some of these people can't find their bathroom. You go to sleep. Sleep? With all that racket? <gasps> what the devil's that? <laughs> Oh, the police won't do you any good, Senator. You should have listened to me. He's all yours. Good as new. Better, even. Frankly, I feel disappointed in our senator. Had the fool paid any attention to your technical specs, he would have remembered that you were designed to stop 9 mil, 762, and 50 caliber rounds. Yet he tries to stop you with, of all things, <laughs> a shotgun. <laughs> That which does not kill me makes me stronger. Unfortunately for the senator, he didn't make the cut. Well, my friend, you're going to enjoy this next visit like yourself. General Farley is a military man. West Point, top 5%, distinguished, decorated, garnished like a Christmas turkey. The general had everything going for him, but vision. And without vision, you cannot be a leader. Without vision, you are a liability, and therefore, expendable. Capture 
capture image and log in target memory. No, sir. I can assure you that the VRS project is deactivated and remains in mothballs in our deep mountain storage facility. Yes, sir. Well, I appreciate your concern. Farley, will patch me through. Son, this is General Jason Farley. You heard of me? Well, good. Now, I want you to tell me that our $200 million mannequin is still down there with you boys. Now, you listen to me. I just gave my word to my CO that this was handled. Now, you enjoy making a liar out of me? Now, put Major Lewis on the phone. Oh! something that could save the lives of young American soldiers. Of course it is. But Dr. Hawkins, that's exactly what you did at the Senate hearings. I think you have to put this in a larger context. To hell with your context. Neither of you have any vision whatsoever. Wait a minute. I opposed the VRS because I felt we couldn't afford to make war easier. I believed then and I believe now that making remote control... The blood control... of our fathers, sons, and brothers is on your hands, not mine. Mr. Rompath. There's no need to make this so personal. Have you ever lost a brother? I think that's personal. No more dead soldiers. Once again, <laughs> wow, this Wampa. If he wasn't a Dynex, he'd hole up in this office for days on end. That's Eric, Michael's younger brother. I take it they were close. Well, Michael's parents died when he was in college. Eric was in junior high. Michael raised him. When Eric joined the service and was killed in a military operation, Michael took it hard. It Nothing is going to stand in our way this time, my friend. The measure of success is the goal set and achieved. We have succeeded gloriously. Campbell and Farley will have the rest of eternity to contemplate their foolish decisions. Now is the time to consummate our endeavor and ring up the final toll of payment for our injustice. Your final target will satisfy that debt. Thank <laughs> you.